There's a project that called Wrinkles of the City that I started in 2010 in Cartagena, Spain, and that I kept on going, doing around the world. And it's a project that really talks about the elder, the people that have wrinkles, but only in cities that have also that those wrinkles on the walls that have also that complexity about new buildings being built or building disappearing or building cracking themselves because of the story and of the place. And I've worked in Germany, in Berlin, I've worked in Istanbul, I've worked in Cartagena, Spain, I've worked in Los Angeles because actually, you know, you don't really find much wrinkles there. But uh, in Cuba, what was interesting was that the people there had never seen on the wall uh, anyone else than Fidel, Che, or Camilo. And really, it was the first time that there was just someone on the wall that was their neighbor, someone on the wall that was just, you know, random people from the street. And I remember uh, doing this project with my friend Jose Pala, who's an amazing painter, uh, uh, who's Cuban-American, and we would ask people that had the most amazing wrinkles to tell us their story. And then we would paste them in the streets of Havana on buildings that were falling down. And this photo of that couple um, is really a couple that we saw on the street and they were walking together and they were the cutest couple you could ever imagine. But I don't know why, but as we walked, we just saw them. And maybe because we were looking for a place to eat, we didn't thought of you know, asking them to be part of the project. So we just say, oh my God, you guys are amazing. Can we take a photo? And I just took a photo with my phone. And, and then we went to it and two hours later we're like, oh my God, but there should be a couple in the projects because normally it's only portraits, but I always allow one couple pair projects. And so we're like, how do we find them? And we started looking all over the city, showing the, the pictures to people. Do you know those people? No, we don't know them. Like we, we try to find them all over and even as the museum we were working with to help us and at some point someone told us well this man I know not the woman but the man he plays music in the street every day at this time so we went and see him and then close by was his wife watching him and right after we asked them would you want to be part of that project and we showed them the project and they said yes they said come with us to our home and as we walk with them they took us in their building and they keep walking up and up and up and up on the rooftop. And they actually live on the rooftop right next to the museum we were working with. And we photographed them there. And uh, then a couple of months later, we came back and pasted them on a, a building on an angle that was completely broken down. And as we pasted, the building would almost fall on us. And we pasted many photos all around the city, but I think their portrait is one, of, is one of the portraits and, you know, that stayed the longest on the walls of Havana.